hi guys welcome back to my channel so i haven't posted a natural hair video in a while because i have been dealing with a lot but today i have this very gorgeous soft roller set for you guys i decided to try soft rollers and i'm obsessed with the results so today i'm going to be showing you guys my soft roller set on my 4c hair I haven't done a roller set, I haven't done roller sets in a while and One of the reasons why I really don't like doing roller sets is because I always use like the hard regular rollers So I decided to try soft rollers this time and to be honest I am never ever going back to hard rollers This, like anytime I want to do a roller set now I'm going to be using soft rollers I actually got these ones, I bought them on Amazon to try them out and I love the results The products I'm going to be using today are from Uncle Funky's Daughter You guys already know they're one of my favorite brands, I work with them a lot and um, I'm going to be showing you guys the entire process very easy and I'm also going to be giving you guys tips to use if you have 4C hair on how you can get a really nice roller set, rod set, styles like this. So yeah, um, if you're not already subscribed, please go ahead and click that subscribe button down below. Turn on the notification bell so I'm notified for when I upload my videos. And without further ado, sit tight and let's jump straight into the video. Okay, so I decided to deep condition my hair before styling because um my hair was feeling a little dry since I hadn't been really taking care of it that much. Um, I like I said, I'm deep conditioning, so I'm gonna be starting by spraying some water in my hair. I'm taking warm water in a spray bottle, and as you can see, I'm working section by section. You want to give the water a little time to soak in. Next, I'm going to be taking Heal and Renew. This is one of my favorite deep conditioners. I mean, it's an intensive hair mask that contains silk protein, avocado, baobab oils. And as you guys can see, I'm almost done with this container. But luckily, I have another one. It's a very moisturizing deep conditioner and it works on all hair types. And if, you're, if you experience like regular dryness in your hair, deep conditioning is very, very important. A good moisturizing deep conditioner will help to soften your strands, make them more elastic so that there is less breakage. And um, yeah, this one also gives you like a tingling sensation on your scalp that helps to stimulate blood flow to your scalp as well. So that also helps with hair growth. It has a lot of really nice ingredients. There's behentrimonium methosulfate, which is a great conditioning ingredient. There's cereal alcohol, which is like a moisturizing fatty alcohol. There is aloe, there's glycerin, there is um, soybean, there is cetyl alcohol, another really nice moisturizing alcohol. There is um, grapeseed oil, argan oil, baobab, avocado oil rosemary oil so yeah a lot of really nice ingredients that really help to keep your hair moisturized so as you can see i apply that to my hair use my hands to finger detangle my hair you guys know i don't use combs or brushes and when i'm done i just simply twist up the section and go to the next section okay so now i'm done with that i'm just gonna let it soak into my hair for about 30 minutes and then i'm going to rinse it out Next, we are going to be going into moisturizing and I am using my special, special super curl. If you haven't tried this thing before, let me just say this now. If you want to try one product from Uncle Funky's daughter, this is one product that you should definitely try. It's so creamy and moisturizing. As you guys can see, it's like rich, thick milk. Oh my god, this is such an amazing moisturizer. They are not lying when they describe this as a miracle moisture cream. It literally just soaks into your hair and it's one of those moisturizers where I mean like if you're one of those people that does the LCO or LOC method you would not need to use an extra oil with um, an extra oil step with this because it contains an adequate amount of oil already there's sweet almond oil coconut oil vitamin A and E soybean oil um, so yeah it has a good amount of oil in it and it's very very moisturizing if you don't like using too many combinations of products in your hair if you're looking for one moisturizing product that's really really good I definitely say you should try this um yeah it also contains glycerin as well water honey and um, macadamia so really nice ingredients that really help to strengthen your hair moisturize your hair and it also does give you a little bit of hold as well so that's also part of the reasons why i'm using it for this um, roller set so after i'm done applying the moisturizer i twist my hair and give it time to soak in and then i split the twist into about 24 26 sections so these are the sections that i'm going to be rolling my hair in Twisting the hair and also helps to kind of stretch your hair, especially if you have like 4C hair, if you have type 4 hair. Twisting your hair prior to rolling it helps to kind of stretch your hair out, which also helps you get better definition. So these are the soft rollers that I'm using. Like I said, I got them on Amazon and it's very simple. Just basically roll your hair around them and just press them down. 
um press the end down to secure it so um as you guys can see i, I start by spraying some water in my hair and then i'm just taking a little bit of super curl since i already moisturized my hair with super curl so i'm taking a little bit to just soften my hair before i put the roller next i'm gonna be using curly magic this is a gel so if you're one of those people that does wash and goes this is a really nice gel as you guys can see you can apply it to your hair and it does not leave, give any white cast it doesn't make your hair feel stiff it's not sticky it's a really really nice gel that also helps to like maintain moisture in your hair so i'm just applying um curly magic to my ends just to give me extra hold and better definition then i'm going to be taking this section and splitting it into four i always say this anytime i do roller sets twist outs braid outs or anything like that before you actually um put your hair in the set whether it's a braid out twist out roller set whatever you're doing split your hair into at least three to four smaller pieces before you actually like set your hair and um i do this because if you notice for people that have like 4b 4c hair or type 4 hair in general where we usually run into problems whenever we do roller sets or stuff like that is when we are taking down the rollers and then trying to separate or fluff our hair and my hair usually sometimes it doesn't fluff well or the pieces don't just easily separate and all of that and then we start to run into frizz problems and that might just mess up all the definition but if you actually split the section first separate the section split it first before you actually put it in the set it makes it much easier later on when you're trying to separate your hair because the pieces were already separated before you put the hair in the set so you guys are going to see it later on in the video when i'm trying to separate my hair how easy it's going to be so what i basically do is i take a section apply my moisturizer apply my gel to the ends for um, extra hold and definition and then i take that section and split it into four and then I join like two sides together and twist my roots about like an inch or two inches, twist down my roots and then I simply roll up my hair. So since I already separated my pieces before rolling my hair, when I'm taking down my rollers, it's going to be much easier for me to fluff and separate my hair since the pieces were already separated prior to me rolling up my hair. These rollers are so easy to sleep with. Oh my god. Like I do not know why I'm just getting into soft rollers now. And they've been out for like years. And I've been natural for so long. But I'm telling you I am not doing hard rollers again. If you see me post a tutorial with hard rollers. Please know that it is a video that I filmed prior to this one. From now on it is soft rollers for me all the way. And as you can see I'm rolling it kind of like in a corkscrew way I'm not rolling it flat I'm, I'm like twisting it around and rolling it so I'm done rolling my hair I think I had about 24 or 26 sections it comes 30 rollers in a pack so now this is was this the next day oh no this is actually two days after oh yeah the lip gloss I'm wearing this is one of my favorite lip glosses now it's such a gorgeous shade of pink it's from black girl fly lip care um it's a nigerian brand i actually bought it all the way from nigeria and it's such a beautiful shade of pink oh my god anyways i am taking down my rollers now and as you guys can see my hair is super super defined like i said super curl gives you some definition so that helps with definition and i also use curly magic at my ends as well so that also helps with more definition to keep to give me um, a little more hold and then um like i said i separated my pieces before rolling it and now that i'm taking out the rollers you guys are gonna see how easy it is for me to fluff my hair i also have a really healthy shine in my hair too if you guys can notice so now i am separating my hair and if you guys remember i twisted my roots so i'm gonna first like um undo the twist and then i'm going to split the section see how easy it is for me to just do you see how easy that was for me to just separate and fluff my hair because i separated the pieces before i rolled my hair up so the pieces are already separated all i just have to do is just pull them apart it just makes so much of a difference when you're doing roller sets or braid outs or twist outs it helps you to preserve your definition so you don't go ahead and mess up your definition trying to separate or fluff your hair and it just makes the separation process much faster and you also get a lot of volume as well with a lot of definition. So you want to fluff until you get to, um, yeah, you like the way it looks basically. I like big hair so I really like to go in with my fluffing, especially around the back. 
for the front i don't really like separate too much because i still want to maintain most of the definition in the front but for the back sides i really go in with my separation anyway so this is the final result i was expecting it to look good but i was not expecting it to look this good i'm not even going to lie i absolutely love the way my hair looks and it's so moisturized it feels really really soft so yeah stay tuned to the end of this video for all the information on where you can get the products and you can also use my coupon code west african baby for 15 percent off if you want to try anything out okay so thank you guys for watching i hope you guys enjoyed the video let me know what you guys think down below in the comment section i'm really obsessed with how this thing came out i absolutely absolutely love this i cannot wait to take pictures with my hair like this um oh god <laughs> oh okay, this is my train of thoughts oh yes all the products i use are from uncle funky's daughter you guys know one of the things uncle funky's daughter is very famous for are their um hairstyling kits so they have like different kits they have um um a kit for um cleansing your hair a kit for moisturizing your hair a kit for stylers they have so many different kits and people usually buy the kits a lot because they're like literally small packs like this where you get like sample sizes of all the products so if you want to try the products out you can try the products before you invest in full size products so recently they came out with another kit that's this one and you can actually get it in Sally's Beauty they launched this kit in Sally's very recently so the kit has um, all the stuff I use in this video there's Thirsty Curls, there's Curly Magic, there's Heal and Renew, there's um, um, there's Super Curls so I use Heal and Renew to decondition and then I use Super Curl and Curly Magic to style my hair this is um, a spray leave-in condition. I use this one a lot whenever I have my hair in twist just to like um, maintain moisture levels and rehydrate my hair. So this is their, as you guys can see, their Moisture Boost Travel Kit. So if your hair is like, if your hair is dry and you're looking for something that has a lot of moisture that's really going to keep moisture in your hair, this is a really nice kit to try. I like that they added them heal and renew to this one. So you get like the complete experience when it comes to moisture. You have your deep conditioner, you have your moisturizer, you have your hydrator so this is a very complete kit when it comes to moisture and like I said they just launched this recently at Sally's so if you want to try the products that I use in this video I'd advise that you invest in a kit try the products out see how you like them in your hair before you go ahead and invest in full-size products so all the stuff that I use is gonna be listed down below let me know what you guys think down below in the comment section let me know what you guys think about the hairstyle personally I absolutely love this I am in love I know I'm gonna get questions on how long it's going to last how I am um, like tie my hair up at night and all of that and I say this every time I do a ruler set or a twist styles or a braid out or any style like that I do not keep hairstyles like this for a long time normally when i do a hairstyle like this it's either i'm doing it for like a very specific event for like a wedding or something and then either the next day or the day after even if the curls still look good but just personally like the next day or the day after i'm probably I, my hair is twisted back up that's i usually like to keep my hair in twist i rarely leave my hair out like this so um i really don't try to um preserve my roller set or anything like that but that's just me i really can't help you guys there when it comes to like preserving hairstyles like this i say this all the time i do hairstyles like this for very specific occasions but yeah um, i think that's all i have for this video let me know what you guys think down below in the comment section don't forget to like comment subscribe and share you can subscribe to my channel by clicking the subscribe button down below on my face on this side also do not forget to watch my other natural hair videos on this side i'll see you guys in my next next video. Bye guys!